You know, just cause somebody smiles at you. Peace, peace, yeah. peace. This your brother Monroe Jr. So Papa John's founder apologized for saying the N-word and sensitivity training. Uh he used it in May. And the call was made to help Snyder avoid public relations snuffers about race after he complained that NFL players protesting the anthem were the reason for his slump in sales. <laughs> Boy, these people tripped me out. So he blamed the NFL players protesting as a as a result for his slump in sales. So basically he's saying that it was black people supporting them because black people wasn't watching the games no more. They wasn't buying the pieces. So he goes on to uh, say that he also recalled how Africans Americans were killed by being dragged by, from trucks in his Indiana hometown growing up. We shouldn't buy, brothers and sisters, y'all shouldn't buy another Papa John's piece. Or, and let your friends and family know. His comments obviously offended people on the call, leading the company to respond with a statement that said they condemn racism in any insensitive language, no matter the situation or setting. Our company was built on a foundation of mutual respect and acceptance. Well, that's been torn asunder when y'all top cat come out speaking like this. You know, you can't hide who you are. Eventually, it's going to come out. It's going to manifest. And that's what happened. How they are behind closed doors is starting to leak out more and more. Because they can't hold it. Snatter also released a statement to the New York Daily News, which read, News reports attributing the use of inappropriate and hurtful language to me during a media training session regarding race or truth. Regardless of the content, I apologize. Simply stated, racism has no place in our society. News hit the company hard as stocks fell 5%. Leading to a $96 million market value loss, Snyder also submitted his resignation to the University of Louisville Board of Trustees following the news. And the source of this is uh, New York Times. So, uh, yeah, yeah, don't buy no more pizza from them. Really, I mean, I'm pretty sure all the executives of these uh, pizza companies think like that anyway. Really, food companies in general. That's why we need our own so that we can buy, patronize, and support our own and, and, and let our dollars circul circulate amongst each other. Since we love to eat so much, why not support one another? It's your brother Monroe Jr. I'm signing off. Peace.